Hi, I am Dr. Arabia Molet. I'm an emergency physician in New York City. Today, we are going to talk about diabetes. Diabetes is a serious metabolic disorder that occurs when your blood glucose is severely high. It affects 16 million Americans in the United States, but for black women, it's a silent epidemic. One in four black women ages 55 or older develop diabetes. Pre-diabetes is actually the precursor to type 2 diabetes. When you come to the physician's office or to the clinic and they test your fasting blood glucose level, if it falls between 100 and 125, you are considered pre-diabetic. Type 1 diabetes is most commonly diagnosed in children and young adults, often is inherited. It occurs when your body cannot produce sufficient insulin. Type 2 diabetes is the opposite. Type 2 diabetes is actually the most common form of diabetes here in our country. However, you do your body do produce a sufficient insulin, however, it's unable to use that insulin. Gestational diabetes occurs during pregnancy, and this is when a pregnant woman develops high blood sugar levels at some point in her pregnancy. The most common are increased hunger, increased or frequent urination, increased thirst, fatigue, blurry vision, sexual difficulties. If you have a cut in, or a bruise on your skin and it heals very slowly, frequent, frequent infections as well. Even if you don't have symptoms, you can still be diagnosed with diabetes by blood tests. So the first treatment to diabetes is, well, prevention. And that is by controlling your blood sugar, even if you have diabetes, also maintaining a normal, healthy weight, following up with your appointments at your, at your doctor's clinic. Be active, exercise, because the more you exercise, the more active you become, you'll be able to maintain a normal weight. And most importantly, find out about your family's history, because you'd be surprised if you find out that your family has a history of diabetes, then you'd be able to talk with your physician on how you can prevent yourself from developing diabetes. For type 1 diabetics, there aren't no preventive measures, but just make sure, be at least responsible and take care of yourself and take your medications. For type 2 diabetes, it's not a matter of whether it goes away or not, it's a matter of how can you prevent complications and if it's possible for you to get weaned off of the medications. That is something that you and your doctor have to sit down and talk about, especially with preventative me measures. For gestational diabetes, that's a little different, however, as a pregnant woman that developed gestational diabetes, it's important that you sit down with your OBGYN so that he or she can monitor your levels and figure out ways to prevent further complications. And hopefully that by the time that you, are, that you deliver your baby, then you can live a healthy life as well.